Hello everybody, I just wanted to do a quick review on this Diamond C Full Tilt trailer. This is their heavy duty trailer uh, with the gooseneck option. I think this deck's a 24 foot deck. We've had this trailer now for about two or three months and just wanted to do a quick review on it since there didn't seem to be too many on Diamond C. Um, so it's got two 7,000 pound lippered axles. So far, pretty good there. I, uh, it's got 10 ply tires right from the factory. Um, it could be better with 14 ply. They tend to sag a little bit with the full, full weight on there. Um, so this trailer right up here has got a uh, gross vehicle rating of 14,900 pounds and a uh, max capacity of 10,520 pounds. Um, so it's a power tilt trailer and I just wanted to go over a few things real quick. So the first thing is we use it to haul a lot of uh, forklifts and scissor lifts and things like that. A lot of things with smaller tires. And this back plate just is not <laughs> not quite meant for that. I think it's for a lot, you know, meant for a lot larger tired vehicles. Things like tractors and stuff would be no issue. Um, so that does tend to be a little weak there. It's already bent in. Um... And these diamond plates over the wheels, this is pretty common for deck overs, but there's no support <laughs> under there. So if you've got something over the axles and chaining it down, uh, that bends pretty easy. So just a few things there, nothing too major, relatively common. And the one thing we did get with this trailer was the uh, gooseneck winch package, which I guess I should have known better, but... If you can see at this angle here, there's no way that the winch will mount on there. I mean, that it's, the deck goes up at too high of an angle, so I would recommend just welding <laughs> a winch right here. That's what we did. Uh, there's plenty of space for it. There's about a foot of space between here and the actual trailer. So I would definitely recommend saving your 150 bucks there. But overall, seems to be a really good trailer. Uh, we let, it has a power tilt with the remote here, so that's kind of nice that you can tilt it up and down with the remote. Um, and it's got dual 12,000 pound jacks up front and a bulldog bulldog hitch up, up for the gooseneck part. Um, so overall seems to be a pretty good trailer. Just wanted to do a quick review on it since there didn't seem to be too many. Um, we'll try to do another review here. In a year or so after we've had it for a while but this is a 2021 we ordered it back in december and got it got it in february so we were pretty pleased with that um so thanks for watching